Hello viewers, Troy from Troy's Digital Arts Channel. Here's a little update on my Aster FPE radar restoration. Okay, after fixing the speaker as yeah, best as I could, I suppose I would have I could have done better, but what can I do? Well, anyway, I've I'm now concentrating on um, fixing up the radio dial. So yeah, the ra the radio dial cord was cut. There's only like a little fragment of it left, as as can see on the on the dial needle. I've uh, ordered off eBay from a eBay seller who so happens to be a vendor for the Historical Radio Society Melbourne branch. So yeah, I've bought ten meters worth of radio cord, radio dial cord, and um, yeah, I'm gonna get it all fixed up. Firstly, I had to uh, I. Like I had no idea what this dial, this uh, dial was for. for. I mean, that's just me, you know, not fully getting things. So I'm like that. But yeah, later on became obvious that this is this is the uh, dial for. This is the actual uh, rotating dial for the uh, radio dial of, for the uh, the tuning capacitor. So uh, string wraps around this, wraps around the tuning capacitor, and wraps around around the. Uh, the dial so it's a so basically yeah this uh this pretty much turns the uh dial cord anyhow it was stiff as buggery so i had to uh put in the vice spray on some wd-40 inside the uh in, inside the uh the screw barrel whatever you call it and yeah i got it all nice and loose then afterwards i got as much of the wd-40 off as i could and sprayed some lift grease in to keep it lubricated so now it's it, the uh the screw barrel things rotating freely and i can now uh mount it back in there and bolt it all back up and then comes the uh complicated task of wrapping the cord around around the uh the uh, dial rotary control and um, around the tuning capacitor and the uh, dial needle so yeah <laughs> I've got a bit of a complex job ahead I was watching a bit of a YouTube video of someone who's restored the same radio and he said he's he's continuously having troubles trying to get the the uh, dial cord right so yeah I'm in for a bit of a rough ride Anyhow, that's pretty much about it for the update Stay tuned for the next video when I've got the cord all wrapped around and hopefully done correctly and it working. Alright, this is Troy from Troy's Digital Arts Channel signing out.